Okay, so this I'm back. Um, so I'm sh sharing and showing what I got from a store called Angie's Discount Grocery. You can find them on Facebook. I'll leave a link below. Or I'll leave the uh, Facebook link below. So I'm in my kitchen now. And what I'm going to do is show what I got um, from there. I didn't get much. I spent, um, and it's all food items. I didn't get anything, I don't believe. <coughs> well, I got one thing. <coughs> excuse me, y'all. That wasn't a food item. And that was um, some dish liquid. So... I got some Ajax dish, dish liquid that's in the bottom. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Got a tickle. So, um, let's get started. So, the food items I got are uh, the the grocery items are in this. They put them in a box for me. They do have bags. You can bring your bags. Um, but because I have my bags in the car. <coughs> Excuse me, um, I, she just put everything in the box for me. I'll get rid of the carpet box. It's been sprayed down, left outside in the heat. It is 90-some degrees here in Texas, and we're expecting some rain tonight and tomorrow, but right now it is just hella hot. So I got $3 worth of these chips. I was, um, I tried, oh, well, one just fell on the floor. So these are the uh, Wise classic american snacks so honey barbecue listen these are so addictive it is ridiculous it's not a strong barbecue taste it's not a strong honey taste they go together fabulously honey and barbecue sauce you can't, honey and barbecue flavoring you can't beat it so they had these two for a dollar this is just the regular bag that is now almost two dollars in the grocery store i got two for a dollar and she said she has some more in the back. I told her when I get some more money i'm gonna stack up on them yes i know it's salt because it's 150 calories a bag and it's a hell of a lot of salt but i don't eat them often maybe once a week maybe once every two weeks but these last you can find the large bag in dollar tree and i did not know that because i don't try i don't eat chips i don't go outside of my norm i don't eat chips that i don't know about so you know i've tried a lot of chips so these right here are are going to be a staple this is a 2.75 ounce bag they were two for a dollar. I got three dollars worth. So I just let that go down there. And as you can see, this is a whole bag of the same. Plus, my daughter comes and robs me. <laughs> so, um, as I said, the only other thing I got was, and I believe it leaks. It's yep, the top broke. Oh well, it, it wasn't much. So I got some, as you can see, we being real over here. I got a trying to see a 28 ounce bottle of ajax for a dollar fifty 20 uh, it's the big bottle not the big one with the handle but the big bottle because it's just me um i just like to stock up on them so what i'm going to do is cut this water off what i'm going to do is take the top off of uh, um off of as you can see i use ajax this is my favorite one the grapefruit but they had the lemon one with the degreaser and they had that orange one so i'm gonna take that top off and put it on here because it's the same neck i think it's the same neck size so i'll just change my top but i paid a dollar fifty can't beat it it's just me i don't use soap uh dish soap that often to go through it but i am trying to stock up because i haven't bought dish soap in a year and i'm just now on my last bottle so that's the only non food item i got from this store i was not going to the major grocery stores that's the major grocery store bag um let's see here okay i'm gonna come up here i take that back i did get something that wasn't food item i found this um this facial scrubber for 99 cents now i crushed this it didn't come like this so i crushed it but this is one of those um cleans and exfoliate things for when you're doing your face scrub so i got that for 99 cents and the rest of this is, um, I got, so what I do now that, I, well, what I do that I haven't, I never stopped doing is wash all produce that comes into the house, wash all meat that comes into the house because I rebag it. I don't leave meat in the packaging. So the only meat I got today was some wings. She had a whole case of chicken wings thighs and drumsticks and they were half price of whatever the price was and they were tyson 
So they were frozen. They got these deep freezers that you can put bodies in. Look like they come from the mortuary. But they have a lot of meat. So I got um, like eight pack, eight wings in a package. I got five packages. They were like two dollars and. 50 something cents per package up to 292 and I got them for half price. So I got five packages for like a dollar and a half. Okay? Five packages. I paid under $10 for five packages of chicken wings. So uh eight wings, 540 wings. I paid under 10 under $10. You can't beat it. So I'll show that in a minute. So they have fresh fruit, fresh produce. I got onions. Um, that I'll cut up and freeze and I wash them. These are yellow onions. So what I do is I put them in, in some cold water. That's why I was running the water. And then whatever comes off, comes off. I'll use this bag for trash. So I got, um, so I'll let them just soak in that water. And I know that there's another trick where you can have a pot of boiling water, get it to a rolling ball and stick hard vegetables not vegetables not grapes or whatever but hard fruit and vegetables in the boiling water so the wax build up come off i do i can you can do the same thing with some very cold water uh lemon juice and some ice right now i'm just gonna let them soak so that i can wash them off by hand but i did get four onions and they were um 29 cents no they were 13 cents a pound i paid a dollar and some change so some other things that I um, got was um, some spices and seasons for Sloppy Joe, uh, brown gravy. This was twenty nine. This was twenty nine cents for this pack. This was nineteen cents for that one. I then found I, I like going there because they have a uh, whole seasoning. So I got some whole black pepper. Badia is the brand that I've mentioned before. So this was sixty nine cents for these whole black peppers. I'll uh, run them through a coffee grinder or. Yeah, that's what I use. And then put them in my spice jars. I am going to do a video about spices and rubs and things because I'm trying to um, store up spices that don't come already mixed that have salt in them. I don't cook with salt. I don't eat salt. or I try to eat. It's very little. If I have to use salt, it's Himalayan pink sea salt or Himalayan salt without the dye in it if I can find it. So, I found some more basil. This is my favorite. I'm uh, looking for rosemary. Um, right now, getting fresh seasons in the grocery store um, is a little iffy um, because of the, you know, cross-contamination and everything in the air and stuff. So, I did get some more of this. I'm in love with this. This is Lana Sweet and Sour Sauce. I got this for, I thought the price was on it, 69 cents. This I use with uh, my Chinese dish i make a general towels chicken or general souls chicken however you say it so as i was going up to the register if you know me you know i'm a chocolate freak uh fanatic hershey's milk chocolate eggs these were 99 cents she had them the, and i want to go back and get some more but she had them for 50 uh 50 cents so i got two for a dollar so that's all the extra stuff i got this will go in my candy jar for when my daughter and grandkids and such come by i'm gonna leave that soap right there so really quickly this is the produce and in the bottom of the box is the chicken so i have a three pound bag of fresh broccoli not frozen fresh i'm gonna separate it into two let me go out i'm gonna separate it into two and freeze it so i'm going to rinse that do, do the cold water method with a little lemon juice so it won't turn. I have now these were the uh, green grapes. Oh, sorry, red grapes. She didn't have any green this week. A couple of weeks ago we went and I got green grapes and red grapes. So um, let me get this bowl. What I do is I add ice, water. When the ice starts to go melt a little bit so the water gets real cold, I'll put these in there, rinse them, do it twice, and then I'll put some more ice and a little bit of ice and water and let them soak. That makes them firm and um, and a little lemon juice or a little lime juice. It doesn't matter. I'm just doing it to keep them fresh. It makes them firm. And 
then I'll bag them in, in the Ziploc bags and freezer bags and the big quart bags. So it'll be two bags of grapes because I need to get some green ones. So um, they had the six pre-sliced everything bagels. These were uh, $1.99 for this whole bag. These are three, four dollars in the grocery store. Uh, I will wipe this down. And in the refrigerator, it will go in a Ziploc bag. So I'm not going to show all this, but these are the five packages of wings that I spoke on. 233 was the lowest. 234, 277, um, 289, and 261. And each one was half price. So like $1.11 for that package. And it's at least eight pieces in each one. So less than $10 for these wings. So I will take these out because they are frozen. They are starting to thaw out because it's hot here. And I had to put them in the car and stop by um, Michael. So that's what I'll be doing. And that's all that I have to put up. And I'm going to walk back over here. Because the first part of the video, I was getting ready to show you all... Um, what I got at Michael. So this will be very brief if I don't fall like this chair. So um, for Mother's Day, I got that storage for my daughter and I bought those, tu those tubs. Those were $3 for both of those and this was $11 at Target. So that's some more storage and it is on wheels. And um, that's just some projects that I'm working on. So, in Michael's, they had these on the clearance shelf in the back by the framing department. And I'm trying to do this with one hand. Um, I'm just going to open one. I got three. They were a dollar. They're just some clear glass cylinders. And this lady wrapped them very, very well. Put them in a couple of bags here. So, I'm going to roll them back up. But I... Want to show you no cracks, no dings, no nicks. Just some nice cylinders that I can use. I want to do some bling projects. Put these on some candlestick holders. But I got them for a dollar. Regular two, I got them 50 cent off. And then, I mean, they were a dollar. And because they were already on clearance, as is, that's the lowest that you would get them. So I got three of those. And I want to this back in here because I don't want it to move and then we're going to swing over here so everything I got was either on clearance or on sale or the 50% off I don't think I got anything that was regular price because I only went in for well I, I did I went in for the paint so as you know everybody's doing crafts because we're all quarantined so a lot of the paints were out I've been trying to get paint from Michael's Hobby Lobby uh target somewhere for the last month and i really just needed red but as i kept waiting i was making what our other stuff with my other colors so i now have to re-up on a lot of colors the basic colors and then colors that i use for a lot of things that i make for other people it will take me a little time but what i'm excited about is we were getting ready to go and my daughter said well mama you never did get any gold so they had this flow acrylic you see, you have, this is a one-quart bottle of Artist Loft paint. I usually use the Craftsmart, but this uh, tells you what it won't do and what it does. And this is craft paint. This is metallic gold. This is the gold that I've been looking for. They had two golds and two silvers, but I may go back and get the other one. But these were $3.97. Here we go. $3.97. Regularly, this is $10. So I got this paint. I didn't get the silver. And my daughter was trying to decide if she really needed to get one. She doesn't do a whole lot of crafts. But I, she knows how to make some stuff. Or repurpose some stuff. So while I was there. I got this snapping spray for the spray cans. that I Spray paint that I use. Um, Walmart doesn't have this in stock. They've been out since the lady said March. And I've tried a couple of of uh walmart so i got this this was like 3.97 so i went ahead and got it snaps on to most standard cans um that way you don't have to put your finger over the nozzle and all of that and because i have uh wrist issues this works just fine easy trigger so i got that 
Um, let's see. And the rest of this stuff I'm going to take out of here because I want to show this so I can put stuff in here. So I went back and forth with this. This is a, um, here's the tag. This is a, there we go, organizer, uh, Abigail Deluxe Organizer. It says $11.97, and I debated on getting it because I'm going to show you another, this one that I got. But when I got up to the counter, this $11.97 was $6.97. Now, that's why I tell people who I talk to, use the app. But if you are in the store, also use the price checkers that are at the end of, you know, they only have two in each store, each side of the store. Use those because you never know. This is very roomy. This particular one, I will not be using for anything, paint, craft, or whatever. This will be for my um, planner uh, items. I have a blue one that I have my crafting stuff in that's uh, uh, about half this size because this is a big one to me. So I want to keep it nice, and it's the color of my house. It's um, black and teal blue. My house is teal blue and uh, brown, so that's what it looks like over there. So I got this one. Ouch, I just dropped some on my foot. So hold on, y'all. <laughs> well, hell, hold on just a second. Let's try. I'm in a chair on wheels, and I'm trying not to fall out the chair and it doesn't lock unfortunately so okay so this particular item i'm just gonna go through the paints so i got um grass green and i got this size this was a dollar no this was 2.99 the the eight ounce bottles were 2.99 so i didn't find white unfortunately but i went in for red so i got green blue navy and I got my red. And I got this size for right now because um, I still have other red. Uh, I don't have any red, but I don't paint that much red. So, I think that's it. Yeah, I got the gold. So, I didn't find any white, but I do still have some white paint. So, I'm just hoping I can get some more soon. So, I found these little bottles that were in the clearance that were by the front door. And I like trying different paint mediums. So, this is a Martha Stewart multi-surface satin and the color is does not say or uh, I knew what it was um this is I don't know you guys oh here it is this is called pea shoot there we go it's like a soft you know pea green sea, sea moss green and then I got the um Martha Stewart home indoor outdoor decor in the color fledgling which is like a off-white cream color now this is a uh indoor outdoor eggshell finish paint so this one is a satin acrylic just you know acrylic craft paint but depending on what you use them on will determine the outcome and then i found some art mine chalk paint and sea foam i love chalk paint i just don't get to use it often and i got it in true red so these were a dollar 57 and these were uh 97 cents there we go so that's all the paint i got so this was the item that i was going to get it didn't have a price tag on it so i found the manager because the lady the cashier just said oh you have to go over to aisle whatever whatever well they don't have them anymore and this one spins around um, so this one I will be using on my craft table for my, my brushes mainly and, you know, small things because I have some plastic containers I got from Dollar Tree, but I need something specific for brushes. So I got this and it matches my decor. It's gray and teal blue. So this I got for $2 because she couldn't find anything to give a UPC symbol on so as i was getting ready to leave i went and got that one. Oh, here it is so i did get yellow so if you don't know by now i am an eastern star so a lot of the things i make are the five colors of the star points uh of ada ruth martha esther and elect ada ruth martha esther and electa and yellow or gold but we use yellow so i got some satin acrylic paint in yellow i was the only reason why i got this small bottle and this is just a four ounces because they didn't have it in the eight 
and I they didn't have the white. So those are the two sides I didn't get. I got this box for a dollar ninety nine, and it's just a little keepsake box that I'm gonna paint and or cover. I think I'm gonna paint it and bling it because it has these groove these grooves. So that's a small project because as you can see, I did the small boxes from Dollar Tree the cork. Uh, board or whatever boxes I painted them white and I'm going to cover them with something so I did get some black this is chalkboard paint because they didn't have the big bottle they didn't have the satin so I got what I could got got what I could got got what I can get so that's that so that's all that I got from Michaels that's oh that's what I went in for I believe that's it you guys I don't have anything else to show I am going to be doing a video soon of this particular item here this is the rug for my living room once um, I get my daughter over here to help me so this is DVT 4040 y'all have a great evening talk to you soon it's time now to go put up this stuff and relax it is Saturday May the 23rd and I'm tired Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You all be blessed. Have a great Memorial Day. Be safe. Please call and check on someone that you haven't heard from or or whose name hasn't been in someone's mouth because we all got that one friend and call and ask about everybody so they can try to see uh, what that person's up to instead of calling that person themselves. So call and check on someone. Just tell them I'm checking on you. No long conversation. Seeing how you're doing. Seeing what you need. Let you know I'm praying for you. That's what we need above everything else. We only have two choices or a few choices for the presidency. And if you don't do anything, get out and vote. And not because one candidate says if you don't, then you're not black. And don't vote for the fool we got in office now because he's trying to take us to hell in the handbasket. I said it, not apologizing for it. You don't like it, the X is to the right or to the left, depending on which way you came in. This is DVT 4040, and you all have a blessed afternoon. Bye-bye.